On the King's SMP, you can craft some of Minecraft's strongest weapons. So when I was killed and my mythic weapon was stolen by my greatest enemies, I knew my only option would be collecting overpowered weapons that can steal players' health, grant permanent effects, and spawn tameable dragons. Then use them all together to get revenge. Starting with collecting the first weapon, the Life Stealer, a sword that can steal players' health and grant buffs upon kills. But in order to obtain the Life Stealer, I would need to kill Minotech, the player who wields the sword. And since Minotech and his team just recently stole the life stealer from my team and i i knew exactly where minotech was so before minotech leaves the area i would need to hunt him down and take back the life stealer before him and his team fully escapes sam's here sam's here die flame die oh, boy, i'm dead uh, my first attempt of reacquiring the life stealer was unsuccessful since i was 1v3ing entirely by myself and if i want to avoid getting outnumbered i would need to reunite with my team to get home collecting all the weapons so my team and i decided to meet up at a village Plan boo. Yo. oh hello I... And with my team reunited, we decided we should try to collect a different mythical weapon until we find another chance to kill Minotech and steal the life stealer. So for now, the next weapon we want is the Dragon Bone Blade, which has a Dragon Breath ability and spawns you a rideable pet dragon. And in order to obtain this blade, we would need to craft it using Dragon Bones from killing the Ender Dragon, meaning our team would need to gather Blaze Rods and Ender Pearls. Because what I didn't mention is each mythical weapon can be crafted only one singular time, which means if another player crafts it before us it'll be a lot harder to get it back but before we could actually start gathering resources to enter the inn and craft a dragon bone blade another team on the server appeared at our village yo yo what, what do you guys uh, want we just came back from a very deadly mission in the bastion of the nether we want to we want to find a stronghold but we don't have blaze rods or anything yeah, so far it's just jumpers all that stuff this team on the server had plans to enter the end and gather dragon bones just like us and since we're a uh, uh, broke pintar one of my teammates had the idea for us to use these players to find the stronghold then steal the dragon bone blade once they plan to craft it giving our team a free ticket to a mythical weapon you, you guys want to like alliance against them Let's yeah that'll be nice yeah I, okay. I think we can beat you on alliance against them just because yes. they have the life stealer and everything. With this team by our side, we agreed to work together to enter the stronghold and collect the dragon bone blade. But Jumper Who, one of our new teammates, collected only the blaze rods, meaning our team would need to gather ender pearls before we could enter the end. So after being gifted free gear from one of our teammates, Yo, oh my, no, you're, Yo. you got any spirit That's diamonds? I got some diamonds. I got some diamonds. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Our team entered the nether where we traded with piglins for all of the ender pearls we needed to enter the end. But while we were heading back to the overworld, things started to get suspicious. You see, having the entire server as your team means there's a lot of players you need to trust. But some of these players on this team aren't known to be trustworthy. For example, Wimbu is known to manipulate players in order to conquer servers. So when I was walking above lava... Pentar, Pentar, Pentar. Yeah, yo, what the f Oh, wait, yo, wait, Dude, wait, who the f wait, wait, wait. hit that? And almost got burned to death joker not made me realize some of these players couldn't be trusted and this will be proven again while heading to the stronghold when one of the custom nuclear the creepers on the server exploded what if i just like sit where they're gonna go that? killing me and almost our entire team once i returned i was expecting all of my gear back but it was clear that all of my valuable items were stolen by my so-called teammates guys so i'm getting my stuff back right it, it, it was it was taken everyone yeah it. it's been it's taken been, yo it's, it's so i'm better at the video yeah. game so can i get my chest plate back i'm not really messing with this the grief from these players had me very close to just attacking them all on the spot but i knew i couldn't let my emotions control my decisions otherwise our plan of using these players as a ticket to a free dragon bone blade would be ruined so i decided to just stay passive as our team finally reached a stronghold and prepared to enter the end until like a bot jumper somehow forgot all of the blaze rods in the chest which wouldn't be a problem except the fact we're currently racing against the strongest team on the server to collect a mythical weapon and while our team was waiting for jumper to bring back the blaze rods oh i spy not so mortal, not oh 
Wait, chill, 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 chill. Wait, 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 wait. Oh my gosh. We were mysteriously attacked despite our enemies having any items to find a stronghold. But it turns out, after JPEX's gear was stolen, he betrayed our team and leaked our cores to our enemies. Which is honestly fair. So now, due to my stupid team, I was completely reset to zero and might have lost my chance to acquire both of the mythical weapons. Bro, it's all your guys' fault, bro. If you guys didn't steal all our gear, bro. And then, bro, left the blaze rods, bro. Oh my gosh. <laughs> that was kind of funny. Oh my, God. <laughs> oh my, I hate you guys. I hate you guys so much. But I wasn't going to let some fools on my team prevent me from becoming the strongest player and taking revenge. So since Minitech's team actually still needed to gather blaze rods to enter the end, I decided to split off from my team to grind as much gear as I could for myself. Because I plan to go get my mythical weapon one way or another. With or without my team, the second Minitech's team entered the end. But while I was grinding gear, Pintar, my first ever teammate, one Wanted to join me on my quest to obtain all of the mythical weapons and after thinking about it so far pintar has only shown me the most loyalty on the server checking on my well-being every single time i needed it so i invited him to my new secret team called the immortal demons this is literally such a peak flame frags moment y you should call me the mortal demon from now on but uh okay uh anyways with pintar and i team together we decided trading with villagers for power protection and sharpness books would make us stronger than anyone on the server and after finding a completely unlooted village i thought of an overpowered plan for us to acquire emeralds all right the strategy is we get a bunch of green duper green duper yo oh we're dumb yeah green duper that's broken you can trade string for emeralds and using a string duper you basically can get an unlimited emerald supply and after trading for an hour pintar and i had protection three armor stacked swords and got bows which makes us very powerful but whilst we were trading minitech got the advancement for acquiring blaze rods meaning minitech and his team would soon be entering the end to obtain dragon bones for the dragon bone blade so pintar and i contacted our quote-unquote team where they told us to come to the stronghold to help prevent minitech's team from obtaining dragon bones and with this being my chance to reacquire the life stealer and craft a dragon bone blade pintar and i rushed directly to the stronghold but by the time our team arrived minitech and his team already entered the end killed the ender dragon and picked up the dragon bone which on other servers would have meant we were too late and they would have escaped but on this server similar to the custom mob twist after the ender dragon dies for the first time there's a five minute lock on the end portal preventing anyone from escaping so now with only five minutes before we lose the dragon Dragon bone blade the life stealer and our enemies escaping we needed to act fast we need to be quick all right all right, all right. All right. Tyra, Tyra, go on the portal Tyra, Tyra, come on come on come on we gotta go come on Tyra. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, five minutes come on come on just go there's no time to explain Tyra. just run in i'm going in let's go let's go come on come on okay go 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 actually actually what so they're bed bombing run that actually was me doing it Alright, they're yeah, just chilling yeah, on top yeah, of the pillar. Our enemies were camping on top of the end pillar, attempting to stall for the next five minutes. So using our punch bows, we would need to take angles to get them down. Oh, no! Mini drop, mini drop, mini drop! In, in, in webs, in webs, in webs! I'm dead, I'm dead. Wait, he's on the ropes. He's on the ropes. Yo, bed, I'm move, 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 back! Back up, back up, back up, back down! Back down. Yes. Yo! Oh my god! Oh my god. <laughs> I don't know blame, 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 in a matter of seconds, our team managed to kill Minitech, obtain the life stealer, and all the items to craft the dragon bone blade. Uh, Flame, I, I backed away so only you can hear me right now because we're in the group. I have the uh, dragon bone and then the one dragon tooth jump as the other dragon tooth. And with this huge victory, we decided instead of fighting, it would be smarter to leave the inn and stay offline until our enemies logged off to avoid any chances of us losing the life stealer or the dragon bone. So after a few hours, after our enemies logged off, Pintar and I decided our team, the immortal demon, we need a secret base because since the mythical weapons can't be e-chested if i get ambushed i have a chance of losing the life stealer which if our team wanted to obtain all of the mythical weapons dying even one singular time would make that process much much harder meaning we would need a safe place to stash gear grind and avoid everyone so pentar and i begin to build the start of a secret base and grind gear until i eventually got offline once i got sleepy but logging off before fully gearing up was going to be a problem because if pentar 
Minotaur, our fate team, and I wanted to craft a Dragon Bone Blade, we would have to wait 30 minutes for a mythic ritual, which would give our enemies a chance to steal or destroy the weapon, just like they originally did with the Life Stealer. Meaning, having fully stacked gear to defend the Dragon Bone Blade was going to be important. But to my surprise, this problem was solved once I received the message from Pentar the very next day. All right, here's the base story of Poison Villager weakness, slow falling, power two bow, all of that. I brewed a bunch of fire reds if you need it. Yep, there we go. We're ready for tomorrow or today, whatever it is. Pentar spent all night grinding our team potions, villagers, and everything we'll need for our next few fights. Which this action alone shows that Pentar really cares about our team and really is the best teammate I could have. So thanks to Pentar, once I logged on, I was able to grab all the gear I needed in order to defend the Dragon Bone Blade at his crafting ritual starting very soon. Which since our plan from the start was to only alliance with the rest of the server to obtain the Dragon Bone Blade, Pentar and I finally plan to steal the mythical weapon once it drops onto the ground and betray the entire alliance since they still think we're cool, which we're not for the record. Because they like stole all my gear, bro. And I'm, I'm not getting over that, bro. So once our teams united to start this mythic ritual, Pentar and I both knew we would first have to defend the weapon from Minotech's team and betray our alliance once the weapon hits the ground. Oh, they're here. They're here. Yeah, okay. They're here. They're here. Do it. Splash. They're here. They're here. Splashing. Splashing. Yeah. Okay. All right, all right okay. chat. Bow spam what? squadrons. Incoming oh. flame frags. Hello, Mapic. Okay, I have two of them on me. Where? Um, uh, with flame frags. Okay. Fine. Can I just have more mana, please? Watch out for a cart. Watch out for a cart. Yep. Flame on me. Flame, please drop him. I'm trying. Zayn, is this part of the lore? Jpex is definitely low. Jpex is low. Jpex is low. I'm 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 low. <laughs> Zam, I, should I tell you where the lore cat is? Why are there so many of you? Hey, get Zam, get Zam, get Zam, get Zam! Never the strongest him. player on this SP. I like it. It's yummy, yummy, yum. yummy, yummy, yum. Yummy, yummy, yum. Oh my god, there's all of you. Okay. Oh, helmet. Oh, helmet. Oh, oh, oh. oh. who's helmet? Who's helmet? Oh. 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 Welcome Thanks, to man. the abyss. Um. This isn't you, bro. Hey, pick. Bro. Oh, oh, oh my god! Yo, W. Nice. He has extra. Yo, yo, get it! Oh, Yes. We managed to wipe out Minotech's entire team and prevent them from stealing the Dragon Bone Blade. Now all me and Pintar needed to do was steal the weapon once it hit the ground. I it's water. It's for the content. Okay, wait, for the got content. It. Guys. Oh my god. Okay. Guys, so oh, what did I tell you? What did I tell you? What did I tell you? Pintar got the sword. I mean, I mean, I he's not gonna give it. He's not gonna share Wait, who it. Who got the sword? Yep, and everyone's gonna lie. Everyone's gonna lie. So who got it? Can we just like? I don't have it. Since our entire team had jumped into the box, me and Pintar didn't get the sword, and we had no idea who to target because nobody was admitting to picking up the sword. But that's until a player decided to speak up. I have, I have a little. Okay, no, 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 no. wait, wait, wait. <laughs> so why didn't wait. you just tell us? <laughs> no, 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 no. I was, I was just being funny. Like this, this is the first time I've ever gotten like something cool on an SMG. So. Wait, so do you have it or what? Uh oh. Yeah. Do you have, I it? have it? I have it. This player Tyrad managed to pick up the Dragon Bone Blade, meaning our team would need to. Kill him to take it. But if Pentar and I were going to assassinate him, we were going to need to do it whilst he was completely alone. Otherwise, we would be attacked by his entire team all at once. So me and Pentar followed Tyrad, waiting on our chance to kill him. Until whilst heading to his base, Tyrad requested to join the Immortal Demons. Now, I took this request with full disrespect because to be a demon like us is something that lives inside your soul. Okay, <laughs> I'm joking. It, it just I just didn't have interest with Tyrad joining since Tyrad is what you call an NPC. But this was literally perfect because this gives us the opportunity to trick Tyrad into thinking he was a part of our squad, where we could just betray him to take the sword. The only problem is because Tyrad has a literal dragon, he could just fly away if we attack him. So Pintar and I would need to find a way to distract Tyrad, then one tap him using a TNT minecart. Yo, Flames, are, are you chill with with uh, me joining? Uh, so you want to stay allied with them though? I mean, I don't mind if it's just us two, because like what, what I was saying to Flame is that I think it'd be cool is like we all have like a mythic item that would be cool yeah and how do you craft the void bow three shulker shells 16 eyes of ender bro we need so many materials for that <laughs> oh my god you don't understand how long i've spent like on this server wait bro how much is, uh, how much time do you have on your statistics i go into your statistics wait statistics I i'm telling you, you tell me how much you have and i'm gonna tell you how much i have time time played you just scroll you see time played oh my oh bro Bro. I'm sorry, Tyra. Right? Yo! Bro. Yo. 
Tyron. Tyron. Pearl did not. Oh, how far does this take you? What the? <laughs> how many pearls do you have? Oh my god, he's already gone. How do you hear that? Oh my gosh. So, uh, I don't know what excuse I can make here, honestly. Listen, I told Pintar to do the carding, not me. C come on, we planned this through Minecraft chat. Something was bound to go wrong, which is a huge problem because Minitech's team was going for three new mythic weapons. The Void Bow, the Pretty Kitty Princess Blade, and the Dragon Bone Crown. But because we messed up, instead of spending our time stopping our enemies from crafting the new mythic weapons, we were going to need to try to steal the Dragon Bone Blade from Tyrat again. And this time, it was going to be 10 times harder since he did and trust us but unexpectedly like the npc he is tyrad some reason thought we were joking meaning our plan to fakely invite him to our team then kill him could still be possible it, play for hacks i, I oh, no way you guys are joking you're just so sneaky bro bro i didn't even, i didn't full car you bro or i would have webbed you i was joking uh -oh. You started red in red. <laughs> bro, are you sure? Bro, you were bowing at, at me while I was flying away. But Tyred wasn't really 100% confident that our attack was a joke. So we would need to slowly regain his trust before he would meet up with us again. Which in the meanwhile, Pintar and I realized the immortal demons would need one last teammate. Since after our betrayal, we'll be beefing with the entire server and would need the extra helm. And after weighing our options, we realized our best option would be a player named Wimbu. Now, as I mentioned earlier in this video, Wimbu is known to betray. Tray. But in this case, we're the ones with the power, so there's no reason for him to do that. And Wimbu is also known to have that demon mindset, not sparing any of his enemies or caring for anyone. He, he, he just lacks the skill. So Pintar and I decided to meet up with Wimbu to invite him to our secret alliance. If we, for some reason, had this three-way, you know, team form between us three, I want to say three-way team, but would, would you betray us? Like, um... Probably not, because you guys, like, have villagers and stuff, so I really have no incentive to betray you guys. Oh, okay. This is a pretty cool team. Okay, at least okay, for week boy. one, we keep, we, we, you know. Yeah, I'll be gang for, I'll be, I'll be gang, I'll be gang. Okay, okay. With Wimbu promising not to betray us, he was now a part of the immortal demon. So we trusted him enough to show him our secret base. Welcome to Pantar Nation. I am on the Minecraft server. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> And with the immortal demons having all of his members, we now just needed to figure out a plan to get Tyra to trust us enough to hang around us. And after plotting, since Wimbu joined our team in secret and Tyrad used to be his teammate, we were going to have Wimbu convince him to trust me and Pintar again since we were quote unquote joking. And because Wimbu is someone Tyrad trusts, he wouldn't have a problem hanging around us again. Especially since Tyrad knows he has a dragon to escape. But this is where the next step of our plan comes in, using elytras and fireworks. You see, using these items together allows you to move at very fast speed even fast enough to chase tyra's dragon only problem is we don't have elytras on the server so pentar wimbo and i would need to search for three unlooted end cities in order to obtain three separate elytras don't even. me neither all right this is a smart idea get ready oh you're dumb as fuck <laughs> oh my god <laughs> okay i think you can log on yo yo log on log, 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 or get <laughs> yo dumb ass Bro, you're one block off, bro. All right, I'm logging in. Get ready. Okay. Locked in. Oh, yeah. <laughs> it has a ship. Please don't be looted. No way. Let me down. Do you know who I am? I am the immortal. <laughs> <laughs> it proceeds to let you down. <laughs> Yo, this is an elytra. We're getting nice. Let's I'm go. getting lit. Yeah, yeah. It's land. With me grabbing one elytra and Pentar finding two, we had all the elytras we needed in order to chase down Tyrat's dragon. But just as we were ready to execute our plan, some reason Tyrat was in a VC with our enemies, where they clearly were trying to lure him to spawn and take the dragon bone blade. But Tyrat being Tyrat, some reason believed that our enemies actually didn't want to kill him and just truly wanted to hang out. So Tyrat was actually considering meeting up with Menace team and risking losing the mythic weapon. Oh, this guy's not real what like why would he okay why would he ever do that <laughs> yeah it's just like an so... idiot bro <laughs> <laughs> you said that you said that with such malice it, it's true like what is bro thinking <laughs> obviously our team didn't want tyrat to lose the dragon bone blade so when boo told him if he was going to meet up with our enemies at least hide the sword inside of a barrel so tyrat decided to actually hide the sword before meeting up with menace team where what do you know they tried to kill him but this is where a new problem started when tyrat randomly decided he was just never going to take the dragon bone blade out of 
his hiding spot so he could keep the sword forever. Which means since nobody knew where Tyrant hit the sword, it would be impossible to obtain. Meaning if we wanted a chance to get the Dragon Bone Blade, our team would need to lie to Tyrant and convince him to hold the sword in his inventory for at least a second so we could steal it from him. So the next day, we spent two whole hours making up lies, pretending I lost my sword, and even showing him our secret base to try to convince him to trust us. Which nothing was convincing until one of our lies finally made sense to Tyrad. You see, we claimed that we found the duplication glitch using mythical weapons, and since we're a quote-unquote team, as a sign of trust, Tyrad should allow us to get a duplicate of the Dragon Bone Blade. Now, the only way Tyrad agreed he would test this quote-unquote glitch is if while he was far away from us with the Dragon Bone Blade, we stayed inside of our base and all screen shared to make sure nobody was hunting him down, which may make it seem like it was impossible for us to get the sword, since if we exited our base, he could just rehide the sword. But whilst everyone started to screen share, I claim my recording software would lag if I started to screen share. And that's when Tyrat told me I didn't have to. Meaning within the next five minutes of Tyrat having the Dragon Bone Blade in his inventory, I would need to sneak out of the base, locate Tyrat and kill him. Otherwise, our team would never be able to get the Dragon Bone Blade again or obtain all of the mythic weapons. Now genuinely, like, I, I don't know. I don't really... What's the best idea right now? What is what yeah, other bro? <laughs> this is this is every precaution you can take has been taken. All right, basically, so first, just literally just right click the chest and then shift click it as fast as you can, um, like with the while holding the sword. I got it. Okay, can you like screenshot your higher FPS or something? Cause oh, no! <laughs> yo, yo, <laughs> you don't know how much everyone into that leash. <laughs> oh my gosh, bro. Use a sword, bro. Yeah. Oh, dude. Oh, <laughs> yes, bro, sir. Yes, sir. The immortal demons. After two whole days of attempts, our team finally managed to steal the Dragon Bone Blade from Tyrat and become even stronger to get revenge on Minatech's team. But at the cost of this betrayal, our team has started beef with the entire server. Our team's secret base was compromised, and Minatech's team was able to gather all the items needed in order to craft the next three mythic item, which our team would need to steal at least one. Since we decided instead of gathering literally all the mythic weapons, all we would need is one item each before we could add out our revenge so our team decided to find a new spot to make a new base where pintar decided to fully max out our base again and gear us up for the next mythic ritual for the pretty kitty princess blade dragon bone crown and void bow to be annoying against so. what oh they started it now our team knew this mythic ritual wasn't going to be the same as the other one since our enemies had two days to prepare and two hours before this we noticed that elder guardians were missing from the monument meaning there was a very high chance menace team plans to use the elder guardian guardian's mining fatigue effect to prevent us from mining into wherever they plant the mythic ritual and after investigating the ritual's cords our team realized our theory was correct once we got debuffed with mining fatigue as soon as we attempted to mine towards the mythic ritual which means if we wanted to prevent our enemies from crafting all three of the mythic items our team would need to think of a plan to enter the impenetrable box they definitely have mining fatigue Okay, yeah, maybe yeah, they do because I have it. I told you guys we need milk. Okay, it's probably covered in obsidian. They have, they're just sitting in there with an obsidian and a nether portal in there. It's another. Wait, portal. we nether portal into it. We just nether portal in there. We built another. We just built you another. Think that's portal. gonna work. Yeah, I, a thousand percent gonna be, will. Gonna they don't have trap portal. It's it's all we got. Our team plans to use the nether portal to attempt to enter our enemy's protected box. Since you can nether travel to any location you would like in the overworld by dividing the overworld cords by eight and building a portal at that location in the nether. So our team decided to calculate the nether cores of the prison and built a portal not knowing what to expect on the other side. Go through, go through, go through, go through, go through. In music. Oh, hey, hey guys. guys. I have, I have Arkin, you might not want to kill us. There's a warden. Oh, Arkin okay, so was trying to kill us. Alright, so they're not on our side. You will never be the strongest player on this Minecraft SMG. Oh, they're sitting. You guys are like their little minions. They're sitting inside like you guys fight us. That's so. God. Our team managed to enter the outside of our enemy's prison, but we quickly realized there were guards protecting the actual inside of the prison, where Menace team and the mythic rituals were being held. Meaning if we wanted to steal at least one mythic item so our team can have at least one custom item each, we would need to wipe out all of the guards and find a way into the prison. Man, 
Yeah. No, 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 I don't have to. Oh, he's slaying. Oh, they're throwing hands up there. Oh, they're throwing hands up there. Yo, let's look at the cops. They're all on me. They're all on me. Yo, you guys should car and cart. Yeah. Yeah. I, I can't. Got Arkin? <laughs> nice. Yeah, I'm getting. I'm killing Tyre. You guys hear? Dude, I can't see. Oh my god, the stupid board. Yes, yes. He's dead. Back up, the shield. No shield. They, they, they did make a trap world. They left. I know they didn't. No, they, the story tells it maybe. It's about to be. I'm with the other. Yeah, but I'm like tanking all these guys. I need to start TNT down to them. Yeah, start TNT. Start TNT. Start TNT. Start TNT. Start TNT. Yeah, play. Watch out, bro. Oh, no. oh, Alright, alright, minute. Dead, 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 He's Wait, oh my god, it's all obby. Alright, all right, yeah, we just leave. After wiping out all of our enemies, we realized the prison was made completely out of obsidian. And even with using milk to temporarily clear out our effects, there was still no way we could reach our enemies or the mythic items. Meaning our only option left would be patrolling the outside of the prison, waiting for our enemies to complete all three of the mythic rituals. But as we waited on the surface, one thing we didn't take into account is the new level of strength our enemies gained by crafting three whole mythic weapons. Like literally hostile cats, the ability to teleport mobs into players, and even permanent strength too. And our team was about to find out their new power once we spotted our enemies heading towards us on the surface. Oh, they're here, they're here on me. Okay, come here, come here, come here, come here. Hi, guys. Stop! Stop! <laughs> Wait, okay, Pantor, go help him, bro. Yo, they're oh, actually yeah. shooting. Wait, what three are they? What, focus Sam, uh, focus Sam. Who, who three focus are they? Sam, Sharky, and Princess. Oh, Minitech is in Mapix boat. Okay, we need to split this fight up as much as possible. You guys don't want to mess with us. I'm a pretty kitty I, now. I, I don't need, you don't need a They have fucking slow falling oh, right. arrows. Are you trolling? We are at advance. They're right on my behind. 1100, negative 800. Yeah. Oh, I'm actually getting play hurt. Play, 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 Oh, the yeah. dagger's broken. Go. Yeah, I know. <laughs> yeah, I just got hit with <laughs> seven hearts. Okay, where are you guys? New courts, new courts. You guys are not here. Their daggers do seven hearts. I need help. I need help. I need help. 900 negative 700. Bro is mad at mortal. Bro is mad at mortal. Peter, help the immortal demon. I need help. Their daggers do seven hearts. Flame. Move. Oh, don't get by that dragon. Thanks. Okay, I'm at 500 negative. Uh, I, hit I hit the back. I hit the back. I hit the far back. I hit the far back. I hit the far back. Where are you guys at? Play. Minutes on you. Minutes on you. I'm, I'm with you. I'm with you. Flame, oh, I'm with you. Oh, hey, Wembu. Oh, hey, Wembu. Oh, hey, Wembu. Hey. So that's the pretty kitty princess. Play. Yeah, oh my god, god. why is that cat flying at me? Oh my god, can you guys get out? Yeah. Alright. Dude, why are they flying? Welcome to the pretty kitty princess. Play. Bro, what is this? Bro, they're just like flying. Haha, <laughs> flip your eggs, you cannot kill me, you cannot kill me, I'm the kitty. Look at these cats, bro. Cat. I'm dead. Insane, helm, helm. Yeah. Helm, helm, helm. I'm trying. Flame, honestly, leave. Just flame, leave, 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 flame, leave. Yeah, yeah, yeah. With the help of my team, I managed to escape our enemies and avoid losing the life stealer. But the same couldn't be said for the rest of my team. Negative Z if you How long to um, a dragon, bro? Don't make him check. Well, oh. What happened to dragon? Happened? It, it took 20 years. I couldn't. It takes five minutes, yeah. No way. Since the dragon has a five minute cooldown and Pintar used it to save me. When Pintar needed to save himself, he couldn't summon the dragon, resulting in our team losing the dragon bone blade, which is something we worked hard to get. And thinking about it, if I didn't run away like a coward, then maybe the person who has been working the hardest on our team wouldn't have lost their only mythic weapon. So if I want to make it up to the player who has been by my side since day one and obtain us all a mythic weapon, then our team would need to assassinate Minitech's team when they least expect. It. But as Wimbo and I were gearing up to prepare our revenge, our enemies strikes first. <gasps> oh, they're here, they're here, 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 here. Wait, what? Here, I'm dead ass. Dead ass, Actually, dead ass, dead ass, dead where, ass. Where, 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 where? Outside the base. Shark, Shark our base? 
Yeah, 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 yeah. And in this situation, I was 1v3ing our enemies all by myself. Which against mythic weapons, I stood no chance. I just can't do anything. I'm dead. I'm dead. I'm dead. Okay. I'm dead. I'm, dead. I'm my last guy, bro. I'm dead. Yeah, I'm dead. Okay, just kill Sam. Stick Sam. I'll pop. I'm half hard, right, bro. I'm about to die. Yep. Causing me to lose the mythic weapon I fought in so hard to obtain, the life stealer. So if zero mythic weapons or really any items at all, instead of giving up, I knew if I wanted to get my revenge, it was going to need to start now by resetting our enemies completely, causing them to lose all of their mythic weapons, and killing them all with or without mythic weapons. So the very next day, despite everything that has happened, Pintar decided to make our team the best base we've had throughout this entire server. And thanks to Pintar, I started grinding for for the next few hours until i had a full inventory of gear which means i can start my first step of getting revenge you see since on this server you're only allowed three slots in your ender chest if i locate Minotech's team base assassinate them all and steal all of their loot then i could practically reset them to zero but if i wanted to locate any secret bases i would need to use minecraft's pie chart feature a tool base hunters use to locate certain blocks that are typically found inside of bases so i spent hours using the pie chart searching to find Minotech's team base until after finding random things i didn't care about i finally located shulker boxes and ender chests and an enchant table which are all indications of a base so after searching the area looking for anything i could find i unexpectedly found minitex team base wait what i think i found it <gasps> Yo. And with Menace team base located, the immortal demons can now unexpectedly get the drop on their team, steal their loot, and destroy their base. So without leaving a trace, my team and I logged out at the entrance of their base and waited until we spotted a player alone all by themselves. <gasps> he's here, he's here, he's here, he's here. Should we just push it? Yeah, yeah, go, go, go. Just go, just go. Oh, he logged, he logged, he logged. He heard it, he heard it. He heard it, he heard it. Yeah, he heard it, bro. All right, everyone's Wait. about to get on. Everyone's about to get on. Now, our team attempted to sneak attack Prince Zam, but he decided to log out to avoid dying, which probably means he was 100% alerting the rest of his team that we found their secret base and would be camping their logout, meaning Prince Zam's team with all the mythic items would soon all together be logging on in order to defend their base. So our team saw this as an opportunity to steal at least one mythic weapon and reset the rest of our enemies. What's I'm gonna do no way. He's gonna oh, maybe maybe some baby go. He's right here. Shift, just shift. Really? Okay, yeah. are we doing this? Okay, we're doing this. <laughs> here, caught him, caught him, caught him. Yep, just kill him, kill him, kill him, kill him. Webbed. Okay, webbed. Go, 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 do it, do it, do it. He's on, he's low, he's low, he's low. He's low. They're both of them are back here. Yeah, they're all on, they're on. No, focus everyone else, focus them, focus them. They're down there. Oh, I see Sam, I see Sam, I see Sam. 770, wait, wait, wait. negative 1200. I see him. Everyone's just gonna go back to him, though, so watch out. Bro, the calves are so annoying. Yeah, they really are. I don't have speed, so. Web them, web them. Yeah, I'll try. You can hit a cart. Yeah, I'll try and web Someone's a light ring over. Someone's a light ring over right now. I don't know if that's one of you, but. Someone's a light ring over. That's not us. Maybe it's him. Back up a little bit. Yep. Flame. Pensar, Pensar, hurry up, bro. I'm potting, I'm gone. Oh my god! Yes! Get the sword! Get the sword! Get the stuff! Get the stuff! Get the stuff! Don't let Maybe get it! I think Maybe got it. Maybe got it! Maybe got it! Maybe got it! It's fine! It's fine! Right, it's, fine it's fine! Just... He's just gonna drag him. Get, get ready to follow him if you can. Yeah. Elytra on him. Okay. Follow him! Yeah, Elytra, you, you guys go! You guys go! You guys go! I don't have any rockets! I'm in so combat for 18 rockets. seconds, bro. I don't know which direction. I got the sword! Oh my gosh, I got the sword! Wait, you, you have it? it? Yeah. You do oh, oh my god, I found it. I didn't realize it. Just keep following Mipic. Just keep following Mipic. I don't know where he went, bro. Our team managed to kill Prince Zam, destroy their base, and obtain one of the strongest mythic weapons. The Pretty Kitty Princess Blade, a dagger that can spawn hostile cats and can deal lots of damage by throwing it. And to make things even better, our enemies tried to replicate their impenetrable prison but instead in the sky, which immediately backfired for them once Mapic accidentally died inside of the box, causing the Dragonbone Crown, a mythic trident, and the Dragonbone Blade all to despawn, meaning our enemies lost four whole mythic weapons and 
wasn't just a single day, but this alone wasn't going to be enough. If I wanted to claim a mythic item for the team that has been by my side since the beginning, get revenge on Minotech's team for stealing the life stealer two whole times, and take away Minotech's last two mythic weapons, proving the immortal demons are the strongest team on the server, then our team would need the final mythic weapon, the King's Crown, an unbreakable protection 5 netherite helmet that allows you to design one custom item of your choice, meaning whoever's team claimed this crown could design Minecraft's deadliest weapon. So knowing this final upcoming mythic ritual was the immortal demon's last chance to get revenge for everything, our team would need to do everything in our power to collect the king's crown. They're potting. I vote Zam out of his speed. Yeah. Flash Royale. Hit him poison. with poison. Oh, yeah. so they're poisoning. I poison them. Hello, Greggs. The immortal player. I've got the immortal demon on me. I live in the water. Ooh, dude. Look, just go I don't know how that didn't kill me. Oh, hey, wait, wait, yeah. Did, did I, do any of us have an eye on JPEX Nation? Okay, JPEX is just playing ultra defensive. Yeah. Sam so, Sam so, Sam so, Sam so. Yeah, I am, I am, I am. I have my eye buddy. Oh, okay, yeah. Why didn't you tell us, bruh? Hello? just started fighting me. Oh. Incoming individual. It's me, I'm the individual. Mapix low. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Oh my, oh my god, god Wimbo, no way. Hold on, Pinter. Get him. Break shield! Oh. Wait, oh, man, man died! This is gonna be our first take the life stealer, take the life stealer. Oh, I got it, I got it. <laughs> the other squad needs to. Yo, Arkin, help me, bro. Arkin, you, you, might, you need to help me. You need to help me, bro. My entire team just died, meaning it was all up to me to obtain the king's crown and get our revenge. And luckily, since the other team on the server was betrayed by Minotech's team, I convinced the other team on the server to temporarily help me through this battle. I just needed to make sure I was the only player to get the crown. This was my last chance. Let's go. Let's go. Uh, yeah, we don't have extra sets, so... We, we, we don't, we don't have Wait, how did you get dropped, Pensar? Bind you, bind you, bind you! You're gonna get carded, Sam! Hey! Oh, oh my god! Oh, shit! That's pretty Are good, you though. Press it. I need help. Charge, charge, charge! Oh, hell no! <laughs> you guys can see Sarah. if there's anything in it. Sorry, Sam. Got you! Charge, charge! Get out. Guys! Guys! Yeah. <laughs> Don't make biggest being trolled. I'm in Wait, back. then. I'm dead. No! Yo, get oh. the door, get the door, get the door! <laughs> Bro, I need you guys to get back. Uh, I'm back, man. Back, we'll go to where the kill is, man. Yeah. Oh my god. I have no water, bro. I'm stuck in a cobweb, but I have so no dead. water. <laughs> what? Bro, I don't care. Get, out. Get away from my sword, bro. <laughs> I meant that. I don't know the ritual right in front of us, bro. <laughs> Shit. Oh, guys, I need Yo, do you fire us? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Guys, I'm OP webbed, I need help. Get him, get him. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. We're not, we're not, okay, go help, Flynn, go help, Flynn. I would like to, actually, yes. Yeah, 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 Zam on you, Flynn. Oh, we stay by the crown. Okay, okay. I mean, spread out, spread out, spread out, spread out. Park in. Woo! Oh, nice. Bro, nice. what are you doing, Flynn? <laughs> oh my gosh, bro. That's nice on Petsark. And I we have got it. it. Got him! Oh. Got him! Oh my! No! Oh got my it. god! I have it! Yo, it drop goes flame, right on your head flame, if you pick it up. Yeah, he now. has it. He has it. He has it. He has it. Who has it? Who? Who? Prince M. Pentar? Pretty kitty princess blade. Oh, they're all going for me. Dead. You drop, bro. You're done. Maybe yeah, you I must have died. I'm about to drop him. I'm about to drop him. I'm about to drop him. 
They're all going for me. The entire server going for me. Why? I don't know. They're not thinking. Think so you, drop your armor, Flame. Come on. I'll, 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 so yeah, wait, I'll actually drop my armor. armor. Dude, just drop armor. It's like Dude, you're going to just kill me. You're just going to kill me. No, I'm dead. Don't drop your armor. Give bro. me my Sit blade down. back. I'll give it back, oh, but I'm God, dead. Yo, let you leave, you I can't surrender. surrender. You're not going to give me the option to surrender. We just I will. Did. I don't care. Uh, actually, we just did. Well, yeah, like, he, hop, off, hop, off, hop off, hop off, hop off, hop off, then. Drop the sword, make sure we okay, pick it up. Drop okay, you're killing me, you're killing me. I can't, I'm trying to, I'm literally trying to. Can I heal? Can I heal? I'm actually, I'm so serious, I'm so serious. Can I get the chance or no? Bro, don't drop it. Bro, cart the sword, cart the sword. When they try and surrender, when you try and surrender, just cart it. Nice try. Oh, I tried to cart it. Got it! They go, got go, this go, sword back. And just like that, I basically threw away our last chance at obtaining the king's crown. I had failed my team and my goal of acquiring a mythic weapon for everyone. And now, our enemies had the ability to create the deadliest weapon on the server, meaning they would become unstoppable. But I couldn't let our enemies win. I, I couldn't run away again. Should I just risk it all? What do you mean? Just try and fight them? I already gave up the sword. Should I just risk it all? Did, if you already gave up your mythic, you may as well. And remembering the sacrifice my team made for me, the funny moment we had together the loyalty since the beginning and the extra effort put into our team i knew saving myself wasn't the goal anymore and instead i was going to risk everything to bring home the crown to our team even if it cost me my life kill you please they're gonna kill me oh my gosh okay, so got it yo flame has it Flame? I have it! I have it! I have it! You guys need oh. to come help me! Yo, whoa! I'm, I have come no help food! Me, come help me! Please! I have 20 <laughs> apples, bro. Yo, I actually have I'm the sword. I, I mean, I actually have the crown. I have the crown. I have the crown. Run back for his positive positive. Run back for his positive. It's on my head. It's on my head. It's on my head, bro. Where's the entire squad that was beside me, bro? They're gonna fucking kill you now, bro. Get Yo, tweak! Out. Stop tweaking, Tyred! Tyred, stop tweaking! Stop tweaking or you're gonna lose the life stealer. Well, okay, help wait, me, bro. I'll give you the crown. I'll, I'll help you. What you mean, give you the crown, bro? I... Bro, just literally just run. Just, you can outrun a Tyred, bro. You can outrun a Tyred. Oh, you can't be stupid! Yo, what the? <laughs> Yo, guys, help me, bro. Help me. I swear Tyred. Kids, I swear Tyred, kids, Tyred, help me, bro. 2v2, bro. Come on, come on. Lock in, bro. They have the bro, Tyred, Tyred. Oh, Arkin, thank you, bro. Thank God. Oh, my gosh. Bro, I need I need to make sure, bro. I need to get away with this crown, please, <laughs> please, bro. Stop tweaking. Okay. Okay. Are you betraying, Tyrek? Stop tweaking, gang. Let's go. I, I'm literally helping you. He's over. Targeting Prince Am will do nothing. Targeting Prince Am will do nothing for you. Okay. Good. Oh my gosh. Why is Tyrek helping you? Oh my gosh. I'm dead. I'm getting away. I'm dead. I'm getting away. I'm dead. I'm getting away. Oh my god. Nine seconds. Nine fucking seconds. Nine the lighter. Oh my gosh! I'm gonna light you away. I'm gonna light you away. Yo. Bro, is the portal demon? <laughs> Bro, I managed to escape my enemies with the crown, kill each of them once, and cause them to lose their mythic weapons. And as promised, I gave the crown to my team. Here's the crown. The immortal demon becomes mortal. No! Okay, so, yep. Uh, now you have the crown. If you enjoyed this video, please subscribe. You may never see me again, so, um, I mean, subscribing is the best option. But until next time, guys, peace!